Good morning. <clears throat> Welcome to Rock Chat Tracy here. And if you haven't already, don't forget hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. If you wonder why I'm being um, giggly, it's because I saw tomorrow's joke. <laughs> oh, tomorrow's joke's a doozy. Yeah, it is. Oh, so hi guys. Oh, I'll turn the fan off now. I was really hot when I came in because we've been outside and it's freezing cold. We've been doing a bit of measuring for, um, you know, where Gary made his base for the shed. So figured the best time to get a shed's Black Friday. So um, he's going to measure it. Good job because we were going to get one too big otherwise. I thought someone was coming in. So the joke of the day then, before I forget, and don't forget tomorrow's one's really, 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 really good. Oh, it's really good. Okay, my age defies gravity. It goes up, but it never comes down. <laughs> That's a good one, it's, but tomorrow's. <laughs> I like it a lot. So, how are you guys today on this lazy Sunday? Not lazy Sunday around here though. We were up early and went out early because Gary ran out of screws. I know, glamorous life I lead. And um, yeah, run out of screws. So we went to um, a couple of places and he needed to get petrol. And we went in the petrol station and it would only let him have for £3.60 and it just packed up and went off. So that was that. Um, but, um, yeah, <laughs> we kind of went downhill after that. We got to the first shop and found it didn't open for ages. And I said, oh, we should have checked. Cause, like, they're at 10. So uh, there we were, waiting for them to open. As it was when we got to the farm shop, we, we were in a queue to get in. I thought, this looks really bad. I mean, you know, it's bad if you queue outside a pub to get in, you know, before they open. But um, a veggie shop, you know what I mean? make much sense so um it's because they've got a really good bakers in there as well that's why and meat meat counter so um once we come out of there we thought oh, i'll have to go somewhere else so we drew further away like to wicks <laughs> but then we didn't have long for them to wait to open their doors <laughs> it was freezing out there though yesterday was bitter absolutely bitter um <clears throat> michael wanted me to go shopping yesterday to maidstone and i I said, no, I'm cold. I don't, I, I cannot go. I just, I am, I'm freezing and it's cold out, bitterly cold. I, I really, no, and <clears throat> I don't want to go on a Saturday. Not only is it that the road works are awful, the road is shut. We'd have to go miles out of our way to get there. You would have nowhere to park um, and all that kerfuffle to get home again and be bitterly cold. Plus, I need to wait until I've got some more money. So I said, no, I don't really feel like it. Um, he, he tried his best to persuade me. But I wasn't budging. I was not going to go. It's too cold. We had too much work going on yesterday, as you know. So most of the time then, while the guys were doing all the electric and everything else, um, I did get stuck into making some stitch markers. Now, look, I made two of these. I, um, I really hurt my wrist, and I don't know how I did it. And I'm wondering if this caused it. But then it didn't hurt to do that. It hurt, well, it's all right now. But I had real bad pain here, but not every single movement. I would open, like try to open something and it'd kill me. But I could do this. It wasn't every movement. It was just one movement. But it was so, so sore. Anyway, all right now. But it didn't hurt to make them. So here they are. These are the ones that are actually angels. Look at that. A little black angel. And we have a little, little blue angel. Look at that. See? Angels. Not butterflies, silly woman. But um, yeah, I got stuck into doing those um, while I was kind of in the way out there. And I managed to make loads. So I've got roses that I did. Look, they're all there, there. Big, big, big pile in there. And the, I've got two of these. Gary's jigsaw makes a funny noise when he's doing that um, that particular stuff. So, yeah, it's because it's got holes. It's sort of like a strange corrugated thing. 
Anyway, yeah, the other one it hasn't got as much in as this one, but that should keep me going for a long time. And I've still got loads more that I can make. Um, but I'm going to try and find some nice other bits and pieces. So I've found a few of these little tubs. And um, yeah, so I could, they have got lids, but I keep my bits and pieces in those. I've got like a little manufacturing going on there. Um, yeah, I was listening to music. You see my speaker. I was listening to music while I did it because it's got a battery. <laughs> it didn't matter if they turned the electric on or not. So yeah, that was uh, that was it, and it was cold, boy, was it cold? And then if I wasn't doing that, I wrapped up some Christmas presents. I have a few more still to wrap, but I'm going to put those in boxes because when you've got anything like clothing or that sort of stuff, and it's squishy, it it's nothing worse than all those presents being in the bag, and then those are the ones that end up getting ripped open a little bit. So I like to try and find a box that they can go in and then you can make it nice and square nice and safe and um it doesn't rip open as easily so i've still got a few more to wrap i've still got a few more to buy too only a few so that's cool so it's sunday today which means giveaway day and i have no idea no idea at all what to do i had this on all day yesterday as well in the house it was inside out because um there were all of a sudden i warmed up weirdly so i just like yanked it off but left it there it's so snuggly really is so i've kind of you know i said there's a draft under this desk here i kind of put it over my knees i got this um i asked gary to box it in i said you know where the um fuse boards are and everything if he could make a like a little box that we could put there and then if you need to get to it you just move it away as long as it, you know, was secure. So spiders didn't get through, you know, just saying. Anyway, so I said once he's finished all the DIY, he will have a go at that. But, you know, could be forever, couldn't it? I think this house is a little bit like the Seven Bridge. Because they say with the Seven Bridge, by the time you've painted, you start painting it one end. By the time you've got to the other end painting it, you need to start the other end again. So um, I think this house is a bit like that. You know, once we got to the end, it'll be time to do something else, start all over again. Ah, anyway, what else have we got to tell you? <clears throat> Not much. I was hoping that my wrist didn't go on for quite some time because I, I thought that's going to really disrupt my crochet. And it might have been, you know, a mixture of doing those and crocheting and everything that brought it on. Or could it be just rheumatism? Maybe. You know, it was quite, you know, cold and damp and stuff in the air. That's usually, might have been a little bit of rheumatism in the old day. No. No, of course not. Too young for that. <sighs> ah, so, yeah, um, watch out for the giveaway today. And the winners, of course, yesterday. Uh, and my swatchy. Lots of people have commented that they like the swatching as you're making it. So what I might do in future then is, for instance, there was a few other yarns there I wanted to swatch. I might make a few ahead and then do the last one with you sort of thing. Yeah, that might work because a lot of people liked watching it. Some people thought it was quite therapeutic watching me crochet. Maybe I should make... Um, a four hour long crochet relaxing video what's it ASMR isn't it and then put it on Rocksteady that'll sort my watch hours out wouldn't it <laughs> shall I do that <laughs> I've got to crochet for four hours though wouldn't I and just put it on a loop no no I could <clears throat> could make some <laughs> ASMR crochet videos couldn't I and click while I'm doing it no, I might end up with a tick. You never know. Oh. I'm so not politically correct, am I? I try. Like yesterday I was saying about it, I do try. But then I'll say something and I just think to myself, uh-oh. Done it again. You've done it again. 
never mind. So yeah, last night I was tired, really tired, and um, we watched some Mandalorian. We've seen it before, but um, our TV was really dark, so I thought we'd watch it again. And um, I'd forgotten some of it, so I'm glad I watched it again. And you know how much I love Grogu. Anyway, I'm surprised I haven't crocheted once by now. Did you notice I said crocheted? That's a heart back to when I was a child. Crocheted, sorry, crocheted one. Back when I was a kid, it was crocheted. We crocheted with a crochet hook. It was crochet. Mm. It's a true story. I <laughs> know, oh, I'm being silly. But uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, watching The Mandalorian. And then when Gary went to bed, I watched a bit of um, Match of the Day because we had the electric off and on, off and on all day, so I missed mu much of everything. I caught up with a bit of qualifying. <laughs> And then I watched the uh, match of the day. And then I went, I thought, I'm going to go to bed now. But I went into the bathroom and I thought, you know what, I think I might microneedle instead. So I did. I did a bit of... I thought, is, it, <laughs> is this conducive to a good night's sleep? <laughs> Obviously, I don't press that hard and it's not that bad. But um, it actually, I don't think it actually helped me. <laughs> I did actually get a really good night's sleep once I've done it. Woke up with some funny noises again this morning. I don't know what it is. I've got a hair. You know, like one of them little baby hairs that you get. There it is. It's only about that long. And um, it does like to come down here. I've got another one that side. They love to tickle my forehead. If I do, like, normally I'll just yank them out. <laughs> but then it never grows, does it? So it always is a baby hair, really, to tickle your face. You need to just leave them, really. But, um... Yeah, so I did that before I went to bed. So I've done it three times now. I'll do another video soon. Oh, no, I've got my hands all tucked up in the hood. That's the only bit of me that's cold. The rest of me's fine. Well, I um, tried to get Fluffy to go out this morning. I couldn't even... Get, oh, it's there. It's right on my eye. I tried to get her to go out. I couldn't even... I'm going to have to get that. Hang on. I think I got it. It was really weird. It was on my eyelash. I couldn't even persuade her to eat. She was just sitting there gormlessly looking at me. I'm like, shh, shh, shh. Bickies, you know, like you do. And she's like, not getting off my cushion. You can't make me get off my cushion. I'm not moving. I know you want me to go out as well, so I'm just going to stay here. And I'll eat when you're gone. That's probably what she did. Because it's a nice day, really. It's no wind. You know, it's not that bad. She could go out for a little while. She's so lazy. I don't know where she gets it from. Seriously. Anyway, I'm going to get off and upload this and um, sort out a giveaway. I've also got to get um, packaging, you're not packaging, postman ar uh, arranged for Monday. And... Um, I don't know. There is another video coming up on Rocksteady today. I did an unboxing yesterday and there's one today and I've got some I've got some ninjas to unbox. Yeah. I had a very, 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 very amazing deal. Um it was Black Friday, plus I could get a blue light kind of NHS discount off it, and then there was a introductory money offer. So in the end, they paid me to have them. I figured I might as well have them then. Because they were the ones I wanted in the first place. Um, well, I'd say the first place. I know I've got a ninja, but that one was so old, it was the only one they made. But, um, you know, when I finally started using it, I was like, oh, they've got so many more cool ones out now. So, yeah, I might use them. I'd, I'd probably keep, probably keep the old one. But I'm not sure, to be honest with you, because I don't have enough sort of cupboard space. So, but it has um, a pressure cooker where the others don't. So whether I will or not. Um, it also has a slow cooker. But I do have a, an independent one. But that's seen, seen better days, really. Anyway. That might get done. But the boxes are so big, I don't know how I'm going to unbox it. You know, when you get a big, heavy kind of thing, it's not that easy to unbox, is it? So whether I'll do that or not, I don't know. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to watch out for the said giveaway. 
and wait until you hear tomorrow's joke. It's brilliant. It is. That one's going to get a cheer. I can tell you that's a good one. I'm going to see you then. I'll say bye-bye for now. Bye. Take care, everyone.